Hello YouTube, this is Tech Reviews by Greg, and today I'm going to be showing you an essential application for your tablet device. Uh, this application is called Seven Notes and is a smart writing tool, courtesy of Seven Knowledge. So thank you to them for sending me this application to review and giving me the opportunity. Uh, so anyways, Seven Notes is a note-taking application, as you know, but it thrives itself on its handwriting recognition, which is probably the best feature it has and a reason why I absolutely love this application. So without further ado, let's go and show you uh, how to use it. So as you know, typing on a tablet can be a pain, and if you do not have a device that is compatible with an external keyboard, you are pretty much out of luck until you get this application. Uh, this is where you can do handwriting, and it will record it into uh, text. So let me just do a quick demonstration for you right here. Uh, it may be a little bit difficult because I am looking through the viewfinder. But as you can see, it works very smooth, uh, easily converts it into text. Um, it does, however, have a few times where it can't recognize your uh, handwriting. But one of the great features about it is that it'll try, it will try its best to recognize it, but if it does get it wrong, you can go and uh, select from the list up here of possible things that you were trying to do. And just for more of that, you can select this little arrow. And if, say, if it actually meant to do uh, Halo, it'll change it up here and it does a great job at it uh, simply to register it up there and start a new line you just hit space and it works just like that uh, you can continually write over so if I just wanted to keep uh, writing you have this option to go over here you just tap that and it will give you a little bit more space but it only gives you uh, about two uh, screen words so you can't just continue writing um, so you will have to hit the space button, which honestly I do not find annoying at all. Uh, it may seem like it, but it really isn't. Uh, you just have to get used to it. Uh, there are a lot of different settings in here to uh, make it fully that much more ergonomically to use. Uh, you have several settings up here to use. You have this menu right here, which will give you the option to uh, actually change what you're trying to do with your handwriting. Uh, you can select the All option. Let's go back, which will do numbers, letters, capital, and lowercase, as well as symbols such as commas, periods, apostrophes, anything like that. You can change it up to simply letters, simply capital letters, simply lowercase letters, uh, only numbers, and only uh, symbols. There are different settings uh, right here where you can go and tweak it a little bit to exactly how you feel comfortable with it. Uh, you can pretty much figure that out for yourself because it is pretty self-explanatory. But I'm going to move on and show you some of the other features here. Uh, you do have the option to change it to uh, stroke, which is the normal. You have this one right here where you're just simply writing. And you can make sure it's all perfectly well. Uh, so it's much more precise this way. It'll just take a little bit longer. And then you just simply convert it. And it works like that. You do have the option for a keyboard as well for taking notes. Uh, so in case that you are pretty handy with a keyboard, uh, you have that option as well. Um, so let me just uh, lower this here. You do, one of the other great features about this is that it is uh, compatible with other applications and different uh, websites actually. So you can go ahead here and hit connect once you've already done your uh, note taking. And you can actually send it to your email, Twitter, Facebook, and one of the best things that I like about it is that you can send this to Evernote, which is a very popular note-taking application to keep all your notes synchronized and organized over multiple devices. So if you were to take notes on here, simply send it to Evernote, and then you can access it on your computer uh, to store that away. So definitely one of the biggest, uh, best features about this is that it is compatible with Evernote. Um, so going back here... If I can just go to the settings and get back the non-keyboard, should just go right there. Um, it does flow very smoothly when uh, picking up your handwriting. Um, I don't have any problem with it. I do, however, suggest you get a stylus just because it will be much more uh, precise and accurate and you'll be able to do it much faster if you're actually using this to take notes in, say, a classroom or anything like that. But it does do very well with just your finger. Uh, it would be a little bit trickier, but I'm sure you can figure that out if you don't want to go out and buy a stylus. But overall, uh, this application is 
It's absolutely brilliant. I mean, it'll set you back about $4.99 in the Amazon App Store. But it is highly recommended that you do so, especially if you're going to be using your tablet to take a lot of notes. Because this just does a very good job organizing it, and it does great for what it does with its handwriting recognition, which is the main reason why uh, you would get this application. Uh, you can connect with other applications such as Evernote, and sending it to your Twitter, your Facebook, and even email. So it pretty much does it all. It also organizes all your notes uh, within the application itself on the main uh home screen if you just hit done it'll organize all your notes here uh, so anyways I definitely recommend this application and is a must have for your tablet uh, so anyways this is Tech Reviews by Greg uh, thanks for watching and I'd just like to thank uh, the company 7Knowledge uh, one last time for giving me the opportunity to review this application so thank you to them and hope you enjoyed